Hey folks, name's Jules, and I've got a message to deliver to you. Don't forget to subscribe to Seasons and Seasons 2. And stick around to the end of the video for a personal shout out. Who will it be? Woohoo! Ah, another happy landing. Now, where can a girl get a burger around here? Aha! There's some people. You lost? Shut up, man. She's hot. Hey, over here. I'm the most handsome guy here. Come and talk to me. Wow, so intimidating. You think so? Well, check this out. No way. My muscles are bigger. Guys, stop. You're embarrassing yourselves. What's your name, cutie pie? My name's Jules, and I was going to ask one of you very intelligent gentlemen where a girl might find a burger. I can bring you out. I can get you a burger. What about you two? I will literally fight all these dudes for you, my lady. <laughs> uh huh? <laughs> you guys really think that's what ladies want? Oh, okay. I think I'll find a burger place without any casualties. Good job, idiots. Hey, look, man. She's pretty hot, right? Oh, indeed she is. Though, Drift, I think perhaps you should work on your approach with women. What do you mean? The next time you want to talk to a cute girl, maybe don't run up to her and scream you're hot at the top of your lungs. Why not? It's not classy. Women like men with a refined sesquipedalian style and manner. Not a brutish babble. Sesquipedalian. Ah, uh, you'll get there, old boy. Oh, here she comes now. Hey guys, listen, I'm new around here, and those guys back on the beach really do not know how to show hospitality for a hungry lady. Looking for somewhere to eat? Beef Wellington, hmm? Drift, be cool. I'd love some burgers. Know anyone who makes them around here? Well, you've got a few options. There's Dur Burger, Sticks, the Fish Restaurant. You do pretty good burgers. Or, counter proposal, I can make burgers for all of us. I really don't mind. I'm just starving. So, big question time. Would you like to come with me? Or me, Drift? Both. Let's do both, huh? Why not? What do you say, Midas? Then may the best man win. Then allow us both to accompany you for burgers. Great. I'm Jules, by the way. You're Drift, and you are... Midas. Well, Drift, Midas, let's get going. Mmm, that was a tasty burger. I know, right? Best greasy spoon on the whole island. Well, don't fill up too much on this oily rubbish. I intend to make you the most incredible gourmet burgers. You won't believe what you're eating. That sounds good, too. I just love food, honestly. I don't mind where it's from. Huh? My advancements using my culinary experience haven't swayed her. How could this be? I must find another way to turn her attention to me permanently. Dude, you all right? Hmm? Oh, sorry. That was meant to be an inner monologue. You blew it, man. Now she knows your game. Mm-hmm. <gasps> I guess not, then. Mm. Sorry, were you saying something? I just love food so much. Where did you get that? Well, Jules, what do you think? You're probably stuffed now, huh? 
Ugh. No, I could eat another bite. Ready for the second course, Midas? Oh, well, yes. Let's get to it. So if you stay real still, your mind will empty. That's why it's called mindfulness. Wow, that's amazing. How can one's mind be empty and full at the same time? It's just how it works, man. Clearly having an empty mind works for you. Hey! <laughs> you two are so catty. I'm surprised you aren't an old married couple. Me and Midas? An old married couple? Ugh! What's the matter? You don't think I'm handsome enough? No, man. I just imagined you in a wedding veil. And I've decided I don't ever want to imagine you in a wedding veil again. It's weird. I think he'd look pretty good in one. <laughs> Anyways, burgers are ready. Yay! Well, it certainly has been a lovely evening. Would you like one of us to walk you home? Hmm. No, but thank you. I don't live far from here. Are you sure? Absolutely. Thanks for a good time, guys. I'll be back around here tomorrow. Later. Dude, she's so hot. She's gorgeous. And very fun to be around. I think I like her. Me too, man. What do we do? We do our best. But remember, there can be only one. Is that from a movie? Probably. Hey, you've been out all day. Must have seen the whole island by now. There's still way more to explore. And today I had some lovely companions to show me around. Companions? Tell me more. Well, at first, there were these really dumb dudes at the beach, nearly fighting just to talk to me. And then there were two more. We spent the whole day together getting food and hanging out. Oh, what were their names? Well, one's name was Drift. Oh boy. And Midas. Oh, Midas is cute. I agree, I think I like him, but I don't want to tell him. What, why not? Because that's how you really learn someone's intentions. Then I'll know if he's really good boyfriend material. Good, but trust me, Drift, not good. He's very cute, but in a puppy dog kind of way. Don't tell him that, he'll go chop down a tree or something just to look manly. When are you going to see them again? Tomorrow. Honestly, it's so fun seeing them compete, and I haven't given them any signs of being into them. None? None, but they seem to think we're already dating. But which one? <laughs> you gotta remember to breathe, bro. I am breathing, you fool. I can't do this without breathing. Just focus on your breathing. So who do you think she likes? I don't know if she likes either of us. Like that. Come on, dude. She's playing hard to get. I just can't tell with who. So you're saying if a girl doesn't show any signs of being into you but wants to hang out, she's playing hard to get. Yeah, duh! Oh, Drift. Hey, fellas. What are we doing today? Oh, hey. I'm teaching Midas not to be so grumpy all the time with mindfulness. Want to join? Sure, why not? Empty my mind, oh wise guru. Ugh. I'm just going to make some lunch. Leftover burgers, anyone? Yes, please. You call me grumpy, spiky-headed man-child. She's so beautiful. I want to ask her out, but I can't tell if I should. She seems to be more into drift. Now, this can't be. What a shame. What are you staring at? Uh, nothing. Nothing. <laughs> Got you. I will find the way into her heart. Well, 
Well, hello, hello. It's me, Midas. But don't get out of your seat just yet. I'm not a villain anymore. Well, it's been a while, and now I'm friends with Drift and Peely for some reason. But hey, beggars can't be choosers. I'm here today to read some comments from some of you on the video that I was in last week. Our first comment of the day comes from Skrilla. He said, nah, fam. Drift totally won that race. He was in front of Midas at the end. Well, I've got something to tell you, Skrilla. Even though I won that race fair and square, Drift uses dirty tactics while driving. And besides, even if Drift did win that race, any man who decides to drive his automobile without a modicum of class is nothing more than a loser in my book. And our next comment comes from Hannah Kozad. They said, did anybody else notice that Midas' voice is slightly different, but then again it could be that he was just treated like trash in the storyline videos. Well, I'll tell you something, Hannah. Yes, I was treated like trash, but I'm not a villain anymore, so I don't have to sound overly intimidating. So yes, I'm a little bit more relaxed. I hope you like it. I'm trying something new. Don't forget to stick around at the end of the next video so that you can find out who got a shout out. We're picking them randomly from the comments. So it could be you. Ciao. What's up, guys? If you enjoyed that awesome video, make sure you subscribe. And don't forget to update your creator code to these seasons. And don't miss our next video, which will be out tomorrow on our other channel, Seasons 2.